Welcome everybody. I have received this tweet where a programmer told me that he was fed up with the Anaconda system and asked me to use an alternative method. If you don't know Anaconda, Anaconda is a free distribution that comes with Python and some packets pre-installed. That means that when you install Anaconda, you install uh, Python but also a lot of packets. Those packets are oriented toward machine learning, data science and so on. But for some people it's a bit cumbersome, me included. What we can do instead of install Anaconda? Well, we can create a virtual environment and install the package manually. But what is a virtual environment? Well, here you have a good description. The main purpose of a Python virtual environment is to create an isolated environment of Python projects. This means that each project can have its own dependencies. For example, we have two projects. Each one has a different list of packets and a different version of the packets installed. We normally create virtual environments, one for each project, so we can always install the newest versions of each, pa each package. Don't you worry because I'm going to create a virtual environment and a Python project and you are going to understand it. Well, we need to 1. Create a virtual environment, 2. Install the package we need, and 3. Start coding. Let's start with the first point, create a virtual environment. If you have installed Python and you should because you want to code in Python, you already have virtual environment which is this one. But I'd rather use PyPen, this one, because I feel it's better and more professional. And we are going to install it on the global Python environment. Let's copy that. It's already installed on my computer, so uh, I have to install nothing. And now we have PyPen on a global scope, meaning that you have access anywhere. But first, Let's see which package I have installed. Pip list. As you can see, I have a lot of packets of Python packets installed on my computer. If I want to create a new project, I have these packets available. And I don't want that. So let's create the virtual environment. We have installed PyPen, so let's use PyPen to create a virtual environment with PyPen cell. This process is going to create a virtual environment. Well, you can see it here. As you can see, on this file we have the Python environment. And right now, let's see how many packets we have inst installed here. Pif list. We only have three. And these packets are related to install things. Let's see which packets we have installed with pipe freeze. And we see that we have no packets here. It's a clean environment. Unlike the global environment, with this virtual environment, we have no packets here. It's a clean project. Now, the second point. Install the package we need. For this video, I'm going to create a scrapy project that we need to scrape or fetch the data from websites. To install this package, we have to pip install the scrapy. Let's jump in time. Okay, the installation is done. Let's see which package we have. Now we have Scrapy and related packets to Scrapy. Now on the third step, you should start coding. Let's create the tutorial project. Let's create a project. And we can use Scrapy because we have installed it on this virtual environment, we have it here. Let's create a hmm, quotes spider. Let's copy this code. And now we can run the spider. Oh, sorry. The tutorial. 
and now we can run this code and it has fetched the information we needed as you can see creating a virtual environment is pretty easy for me it's even easier than using anaconda remember you have to install pipemp then you install the package you need then you start coding don't worry because i'm going to leave all these links on the description box and also i'm going to leave a link to my scrippy tutorial videos where you can learn how to use scrippy in about an hour i hope you have learned something new today and i will see you on my next video